Hi everyone, welcome back to Discovery World at Home. This week we are talking about flight. In the Ryman Aquarium, our best flyer is Susie the Cownose Ray. Cownose rays are a species of eagle ray, a group of rays that also includes manta rays. This group of rays spends most of their time in the open ocean, unlike other species would spend the majority of their time on the seafloor. Cownose rays and other species in the eagle ray family spend much more time swimming than other species of ray, which spend the majority of their time resting on the bottom. You may notice when watching our rays at Discovery World that our Cortez round rays and Atlantic rays in the touch tank stay near the bottom and don't move much unless they're getting food. However, when you see Susie the cow nose ray in the Caribbean tunnel, she's regularly swimming near the surface of the tank, gracefully flapping her wing-like fins and continually moving. Most stingrays, like the stingrays in our touch tank, move by undulating their pectoral fins. This means that they move their fins in a wave-like motion from front to back to help them move through the water. Unlike other species of rays that have a round body shape, Cownose rays and other eagle rays are characterized by their wing-like fins, making them much wider than they are long. These enlarged pectoral fins extend almost the entire length of their body and come to a point, just like a wing. To move through the water, these rays will flap their fins like a bird flapping its wings. Birds use strong muscles to flap their wings and create thrust and force air under their wings, which will give them lift and allow them to fly. Similarly, when stingrays like the cow nose ray flap their fins, they are forcing water under themselves to fly through the water. Cow nose rays and other species of eagle rays are excellent swimmers. Several species of ray, including the cow nose ray, are even able to fly through the water so well that they are able to breach the surface and jump out of the water, giving the appearance of flying. While it's not known for sure why they do this, some theories include showing off to attract a mate, removing parasites from their skin, or trying to communicate with other stingrays. Thank you for listening. Be sure to check out our Facebook page and website for more Discovery World at Home resources, and be sure to watch us live from the Ryman Aquarium every Tuesday at 1.